So this morning, the state of Idaho continues presenting its case against cult mom, Lori Vallow Daybell. She's accused of conspiring to kill her two kids and her fifth husband's late wife. To me, it's just, it's just baffling. And especially when we're hearing from all of these witnesses how healthy, how she'd like to run. And, um, you know, she's in like the prime of her life. And, and this happens, you know, it's just, it's, it's really, really weird. Uh, Brian Silber, tell me, if you're representing Lori Vallow Daybell and you're hearing all of this testimony about Tammy, how concerned or not concerned uh, would you be uh, for Lori's defense here uh, with respect to what happened to Tammy? So this is how I feel about this case. It's a circumstantial case, but it's a strong one. You know, have you ever been in a movie theater, let's say watching a movie, and then when you leave the theater, you go outside and it's obvious it was pouring rain while you were in there. You didn't hear the rain, you didn't hear the thunder, you didn't see the lightning, but everything is soaked. And that, that's how I take this case. You know, there's no direct evidence here. There's no eyewitness, there's no confession, there's no video. Uh, but clearly these circumstances are very questionable. And I think the testimony of the sister uh, that indicates that Tammy was, you know, very strangely, uh, you know, her death circumstances are bizarre. Uh, certainly an autopsy should have been done. I agree with Corey on that 100%. Um, but this is the case of strong circumstantial evidence. And uh, I feel it's just like that rainstorm in the movie theater. Mm -hmm. I love that. Do you use that at your jury trials, Brian Silber? Is that the example you <laughs> give? It's a good one. I love it. Yeah, it's uh, you know, circumstantial cases are not a bad thing. I can't emphasize that enough. When it's, I think it's like a saying from movies, or you know, when people say, "Oh well, it's circumstantial." Yeah, and that can be sometimes the best evidence out there. Uh, so not necessarily a bad thing. Brian Silber, Corey Piggies, we are just getting started.